Wow, this place is incredible. Hi, I'm Sarah St. Marceau with Portfolio Real Estate, and we're here today to give you a tour of 17011 Saddle Ridge Pass. Now this home was built in 2005. It's got over 8,307 square feet of living space from the main house to the guest house. We've got a barn, we've got a storage warehouse, we've got a pool, a spa, cross-fenced pastures, a fully stocked pond with bass fish, a sports court, and so much more. This is gonna be a great tour, guys, and I can't wait for you to see it all. Wow, this place is incredible. Oh my goodness, look at the detailing on the walls. Look at the detail on the paint here. Now this was done by a local Venetian painter. She put in all the detailing that you're gonna see throughout the house, from the columns here to all of the faux painting that you're gonna see on the walls, on the staircase. We're gonna take you through this house and you're gonna see all the amazing details that have been put into the planning of this home. The first thing you notice when you walk into this house is just the amazing height and detail in the space. So we've got a two-story foyer here, a beautiful curved staircase with iron railing detail. And something that I mentioned you're gonna notice throughout is just the detailing on the painting here. Now, right off the walkway in the main foyer, we've got this beautiful dining room. And as you can see, it's adorned by these columns, which have been faux painted, as you see, to really look like marble. This is absolutely gorgeous. A lot of space in here for entertaining. You can see we've got travertine tile flooring, which is really nice and easy to maintain and just beautiful. What's nice about the dining room is it flows right into the living room right here and the kitchen. So again, very easy for entertaining and just a lot of room for whatever you might need. And the best part is you've got a little wine cellar over here. So as you're getting ready to serve dinner, it's just easy to come over here and grab your favorite bottle of wine. All right, coming into this beautiful living room, we've got dramatic two-story ceiling and look at the wood detailing up here. Absolutely stunning. This house has such a nice, easy, open, flowing floor plan, and the living room just flows nicely from the entryway, the dining room, and right into the kitchen. You've got this wonderful breakfast bar here, beautiful granite throughout, and lots of cabinet space. Now, custom cabinetry throughout the kitchen, Something else you're really gonna love, if you love to cook, you've got a Frigidaire Professional Series with a five burner gas cooktop. You've got the oven and a warming drawer underneath. You've got two sinks so you can do your food prep here and leave your dishes over there. You've got this amazing Viking Professional built-in refrigerator. So just everything that you could possibly want in your kitchen. You've got some dish shelves here, some places to store the glass. All right, so right off the kitchen, we've got this full bath. What's really nice is you've got access to the outside. Full-size laundry room with lots of space, washer and dryer. You've got a folding table here, and of course, plenty of storage, and even a sink to wash your delicates. All right, so right off the main entryway, we've got this beautiful study. The way they did the paint in here almost looks like suede, and it just makes you feel really warm. This will be a great place to come in and just get all of your work done. All right, so let's go take a look at the primary suite. You guys are gonna be blown away by what's in here. Now, right off the main entrance, we've got a hallway that leads us into the primary suite got these beautiful wood double doors that lead into the primary suite. And something that's really cool and it's always been a dream of mine is to have this dual fireplace between the bedroom and the bathroom. Notice the detailing of the custom paint in here and something that's really cool that the owner did is they added a layer of gold dust into the paint. You can really see it here in the daylight as it's reflecting, and then just imagine it at night as it reflects on the lights. Just a really nice ambiance. It's almost kind of like you're living outdoors and you've got the stars above you. 
This bathroom is spectacular. You've got actual Venetian plaster on the walls. You've got this dual fireplace, this huge bathtub. I mean, just imagine sitting in here with the fire going, you've got a glass of wine. That's what I would do if I was in here. And you've got this massive shower with not one, but two shower heads. There's also these beautiful countertops. You've got dual vessel sinks and just plenty of storage space in here. And of course, beautiful travertine tile flooring. And what would a primary suite have if it didn't have a massive closet? This closet is huge. You have not one, not two, but three levels on which to store your clothing. And the very top level has a rod where you can just pull it down for short people like me. Of course, you've got custom shelving here to store hats, purses, shoes, whatever you like, but just tons and tons and tons of storage space for your clothes, your shoes. And over here, you've even got your own shoe closet, which I love. All right, now we've seen the entire first floor. We're gonna go upstairs and see some more amazing features about this home. Wow, this second floor is incredible. Not only do you get a little peek over here to the first floor, but this is where all the entertaining happens when you're done eating. Let's take a look. Right above the living room, you've got this massive game room. You look at the size of this. You could put a pool table in here, maybe a foosball table over here. You could have another TV for watching the game. Great place to watch football if you wanted to. And what's really cool is you've got access to an outdoor balcony here. So you can come out after you play pool, just sit out, relax, maybe have a beer or sip on some iced tea. Something that is a really cool feature about this house, and you're probably not gonna see this in too many houses, is you've got your very own arcade room. Who wouldn't wanna come in here and be a kid again and just play some pinball, maybe your favorite arcade game? I didn't know this was back here. Look at this, you've got your own secret hiding space or a panic room or just extra storage. How cool is that? So let's walk back to the other side of the second floor where we've got three large guest bedrooms. Look at this, this is like the size of my bedroom in Manhattan and this is a closet. To love. Look, you've got the makeup counter, you've got custom shelving and drawers, you've got this amazing light fixture in the middle. How cool is this closet? Now this section of the house behind me was actually added in 2016. Oh my god, this place is fantastic. Look at this theater room. You've got enough seating for 10 people, maybe more if you throw some bean bags down here. The beautiful wall paneling here. How cool is this space? I could totally imagine coming in here with my family, my friends, sitting down with my favorite candy, soda, some popcorn. Sitting back, oh, there we go, yes. Watching my favorite film. This home cinema is state of the art. You've got this massive projector screen, projector back here that's built in. You've got built-in surround sound. You've got an entire audio video tower here, which by the way, something you need to know about this house, the owner spent over a quarter of a million dollars fully automating this home. Everything from putting a movie on to sound, to the fountain that you saw back in the entryway, to opening the gate, to turning on the lights, the alarms, all of this can be controlled directly from your phone. Now, after you've eaten all the candy, popcorn, and had all the soda, you're probably ready to work those calories off. Why not do that from your own home gym? This home gym has shock padding flooring. You've got this built-in TV right here, so you can keep watching your favorite movie while you get a workout in. Well, now that I've worked off all my calories, I'm ready to have some more snacks. And right outside of the theater room, you've got this great little kitchenette. You've got a sink here. You've got a full-size dishwasher, so you can wash everything when you're done. Lots of storage space, an ice maker in Texas, that's really important. And of course, a beverage cooler. This pool is 
gorgeous. Look at all this space for swimming. You've got your hot tub over here. You've got your waterfall, the grotto. You've got covered patio here. Wow, would you look at this place? This is a guest house. You'll never want to leave when you come in here. This is fantastic. Look at the beautiful wood beams across the ceiling. Got this gorgeous, gorgeous light fixture here. Guys, there's a Bertazzoni oven in the guest house. Are you kidding me? This is amazing. Top of the line oven with five burner gas cooktop. Beautiful travertine stone backsplash. Just incredible. Top of the line granite here. Wow. You've got this gorgeous farmhouse sink with copper finishes, bronze fixtures. This is like the fanciest trash receptacle I have ever seen. Everything just like built in. What is this? Oh my God, this is a dishwasher. This is amazing. And of course you got this awesome breakfast bar where you can just, your guests can sit here and have breakfast, relax, have their coffee as they're getting ready for the day. This is spectacular. What else do you need when someone's staying here for a long time? Well, they probably at some point have to do their laundry. So there's a full size laundry room in the guest house. Now this guest house has a full bedroom with a full bath on this side, another full bedroom with a full bath on that side. So plenty of room for your guests to just relax and enjoy the space. So if you're on a farm and ranch, what do you have to do? You have to store your equipment, right? You're gonna have ATVs because you gotta get around the property. You might even have a tractor, a riding lawnmower. And if you love to play, you might have a few motorcycles in here as well. So what better place to store it than in this massive storage warehouse? You've got your fridge in here. You've got a little kitchenette. Of course, you've gotta have the ice maker because it's Texas and it's hot. You've got plenty of space to put in your horses, or maybe you've got some baby goats, maybe a donkey. There's a duck, we're gonna go around that. All right, and here you've got the tack room where you can keep your feed, pull out drawers where you can actually keep the feed. All right, we're ready to go take a walk around the property now. Now, this is all set on 3.17 acres of land. We've got some pastures back here. Everything is cross-fenced, and as you saw coming in, it's gated. And there's a fully stocked pond over here with bass fish inside. Imagine ending your days here, sitting by your beautiful pond filled with bass fish. If I had some fishing gear, I might even be fishing right now. That's a wrap. Thank you so much for joining us on this tour of the beautiful 17011 Saddle Ridge Pass. For more information about this property, you can call us at 713-766-1000 or go to our website at portfoliorealestatetx.com. Thanks and I'll see you next time.